Anyways, welcome to Ibiza, the international worldwide known little island for their nightlife and the hippie lifestyle. They have lots of small beaches, they call them gala. Hey guys, so I just got to Ibiza and um, I got up pretty early today at like 6. So I got a solid like maybe two hours of sleep, but you know what? Had my Coke Zero. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. My name is Luca and I am a college student traveling. I am going on an EF tour, which is basically like group travel and it's a really affordable option. Plus they plan every single thing for you. Like it is so easy, like your flights, your hotel activities, all you need to do is show up. So amazing. and. So so convenient and makes traveling like so convenient. I can't even tell you guys. So I will link all the information down below and along with a code that you can use for some money off if you would like to. But anyways, we are staying three nights in Ibiza. I've never been and I'm so excited. Ah! And this room is so nice. We're staying at a hostel, which I've never stayed at before and I was a little bit worried. Like I wasn't sure how it was gonna be, but I'm very surprised. It is really cute in here. It seems very quiet as well. So I'm staying by myself, but that was like an upgrade. You can also stay with other people. I will give you guys a little tour before all of my stuff goes all over it. So this is my two beds and then the walls are pink. I'm loving. Here is me. This is my outside area. Don't have much time to vlog right now, but I have a wine tasting tonight. I have never gone to a wine tasting. And I swear, this is like the most activities I think I've ever had on vacation. Like EF did such a good job. Well, first of all, our tour guide, Sarai, is so good. So if you guys have the chance, definitely take a tour with her. She's amazing, literally 10 out of 10. She recommends the best places and takes us to the coolest spots. I spent the pretty much the whole day at the beach. And guys, how do I have energy when I literally got two hours of sleep last night. I have no idea. I'm like just a bit dehydrated and like my head's pounding, but head's let's pounding. go. My let's have some wine. Pounding. Yeah, it's like wine time. I'm currently on the wine tasting and we're getting a tour. I'm very excited. Yeah. Yep. We can start walking and I will run through with you the process we've... Uh... This kind of reminds me of Italy, the trees. This machine here, and this machine here, um, takes, uh, separates the, the grapes from the leaves and the branches. Oh my god, I got sunburned. I feel like you guys are all my parents. <laughs> I don't know if that's so a young. compliment. Yeah. Thanks, mom and dad, for letting me try my first glass of wine. <laughs> now, don't drink it all at once. Pa arriba, pa dentro, pa el centro. Pa arriba, pa abajo. Oh, water? I thought you were literally like, what are you? No, Luca, that's not what you do. You go back to the wine. You guys, I'm giving you my silly goofy mood. Palencia Bruno. A moment to take in everything. It's like a moment of silence. So important to take in moments. Straight up say to yourself what you appreciate. 
about each moment because I feel like it just passes me by sometimes and I'm like not taking it in or I'm not present or I'm on my phone and I really try to not do that as much as I can. It makes moments like these where you just have like a second of peace to take a breath and slow down and just think like, wow, I'm so grateful for where I am and I am grateful for where I'm going and no matter what worries I have, I'm just glad to be alive. Wow, I'm getting really deep. It's the wine speaking for me. <laughs> um, no, I just want to express my gratitude for you guys because if it weren't for you guys, I wouldn't have I wouldn't have the ability to travel and to share this experience with you guys. So thank you. Like, thank you. Some of you guys have been with me for like years and i think that's so crazy and and i really am so grateful for you guys like please know that again if it weren't for you i wouldn't i wouldn't be in freaking ibiza in this beautiful vineyard this is probably my favorite activity we've done yeah thank you a million times and my heart is so full and i love you all so very much what if i just fall and since we came from a wine tasting I got us some grapes, of course. Aww. 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 We're ending our night with this beautiful view. Well, actually, we're not even ending our night because we still haven't had dinner. Because <laughs> Spanish people eat dinner so freaking late. Honestly, I'm not even hungry. It's from all the wine. Anyway, this view is so spectacular and it's amazing. <laughs> oh my god. That's crazy. Do you want to take a picture? This is insane. Let's go. Dude, if I slip, it's kind of over for me. It's game over. It's game over. Whoa! The lighting's really good right here. Yeah? Good morning and it is a fantastic morning do you know why because I got sleep I am honestly so thankful to my past self for choosing not to stay out late last night this morning I'm going to get breakfast I also have to do a little work we're going on a catamaran today and I don't know something about it here guys the energy is just really good it was a full moon last night and I just I don't know, I felt super grateful last night. About to get some coffee. We all just got matching friendship bracelets, except for they're all in boy names. Yeah. <laughs> I got Luke, Miguel, Miguel, Carlos, Carlos, <laughs> tres amigos. <laughs> Good morning guys, so we started today off pretty early 
for my liking, but but I'm powering through. We're at this um, really pretty view viewpoint in Ibiza town. Ibiza. Abita town. I don't know how to say it. I feel like every time I say it differently, so whatever. But it's so pretty and it definitely reminds me of Puglia in Italy a lot. It definitely resembles Greece, like white brick, really quaint, kind of old. <laughs> the town. Ibiza, Ibiza. Ah, everything. Anyway, it's so freaking cool here. I'm out of breath from walking. That's not good. But yeah, there's like nobody here and all the shops are so adorable. Hi guys, so I'm at an activity right now. We are making our own liqueur. So we just collected some, how do you call it? Plants, I don't, I'll think of the name. Some of those in the garden. Okay. Berries and cream, berries and cream, berries mm. and cream. Now we put. Estoy feliz. Oh. Thing. It's kind of dark in here right now, but hello. <gasps> it's currently 9.18. I'm eating dinner at 9.18 in the nighttime. This schedule, this eating schedule has me so thrown off, I kid you not. But I'm heading out to dinner and I'm going to go to this pasta place. Leave me a comment down below where you guys think I should go next because I'm definitely thinking about either Greece or... Honestly, Greece is at the top of my list at the moment, so maybe I'll go with some of the people that I met on this trip. I got so much back, I think I'm never running out. Yeah, bust me down a little bit, I don't do this for no clout. Hey, I got so much back, I think.